expected to continue its third round of uh, salary negotiations with organized labor. And uh, we'll be having a, a, an in-total discussion on that in a while. But uh, organized labor, we are told, has so far tabled over 30% calling on government to consider that amount. Uh, labor correspondent um, Daniel Opoku has joined us uh, in studio for a quick discussion on this. Daniel, good afternoon. Thank you for right, your... Good afternoon to you, Martin. I mean, is, labor should also be cognizant of what's happening in the economy. 30% is a bit much, isn't it? I mean, so you tell us what exactly has gone on in the last two meetings. We are expecting a third meeting, yeah? Right. So the last two meetings, Labour tabled to the figure that you mentioned, between 30 to 50%. That's what they have tabled before government. And right. government also, we are told, came along with some kind of 8% and all that. And that has you not been... under 10%. Exactly, below 10%. And Labour has not been too happy with that. And when we look at a single spine salary structure, every year, there's supposed to be some 2% increases on the year in terms of salaries for those mm. who benefit from the public from, from the single spine salary structure. And so the third round of negotiations will supposed to take place tomorrow. Labor is expecting that government will inch up the figure a bit from the current 8%, 10% to something that will be meaningful to all of them. Because the, the reasons that they cite are the fact that they look at current economic conditions, they also look at the inflation, inflationary rates and also affecting the pockets. These are the reasons Labor mm. uh, are putting out. So basically tomorrow, let's see what they were asking. I want to also see what government will also be tabling before them, right. and then they'll be able to make a headway. Because government must agree on something yeah. before the 2023 budget can be read. Right. And, and then, so if the single spine structure right. says that every year there should be 2% increment, mm. for how long has this been, and has that 2% been consistent, or there was a lull somewhere for which reason organized labor things that more and you know, now we want <laughs> between 30 to 50 percent. So, you know, the, the, the single spine salary structure implementation started around 2010. Right. From 2010 till now, every year there's supposed to be some kind of slight right. increase yeah. for the public sector workers. But unfortunately, that has not been implemented. And this right. time around, labor is drawing the attention of government. Okay. That over this, uh, let's correct this anomaly and let's move forward for the next negotiation, see what can be done. Because Workers are expectant. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They're expecting their leadership to negotiate something better for them. Judging from the 4% and mm. the 7%, they want something better this time okay. around. All right. Uh, certainly, uh, that meeting is uh, one that we'll be keeping close eye on. Daniel Opoku, thank you very much. He's